Ladies and gentlemen, hello and welcome back again to Majid Sand channel for reviewing and describing fragrances. My pleasure to share with you my discovering of what I discover in this year. Number one, Emirate Al Arab or Princess of Arabia. This is a great clone from uh, Asdaf House, the Middle East brand, uh, for Emperor Armani My Way or uh, Giorgio Armani My Way. The presentation is perfect luxury and the scent the profile is so so beautiful wow i think uh, this is not a clone this is a designer fragrance in clone bottle so uh, the profile here is a citrusy white floral musky after that uh, you're gonna smell a lot of white flowers uh, due to the jasmine and the base contains some wood with woods uh, make it uh, last longer time really i recommend this fragrance for uh, all purposes of the day but it's so so beautiful another fragrance that i discovered this year and i uh, really really love this smell this is like clean shampoo how does dylan blue perform uh, smell it's it smell fr very fresh very fruity scent clean and pleasant at the same time uh, there is some women that search for only one fragrance for spring and summer at the same time i highly recommend dylan blue perfume also it comes with a good presentation and a beautiful presentation like you see this um, small sample here another great designer fragrance from the house of chanel chanel chance I think a lot of women uh, know this smell instead of its classical fragrance but till now it's still one of the greatest releases by the house of Chanel uh, why of course the nose behind this one was Jack Polk in 2002 and in this era of time we see a new concept of cheppery fragrances the patchouli mixed with uh, good blood of uh, citruses and pineapple uh, make it so uh, so cheppery so uh, so I, I really love this style of fragrances on women like Coco Mademoiselle and also if you want to use this fragrance you can use it at any situation comfortably um, very sophisticated fragrance by chanel when you wear this fragrance you're gonna, you're gonna be confidence boasting and what. so chance by chanel uh, i highly still recommend this fragrance instead of it a classical scent the joker fragrance for women of all time i still recommend c by giorgio armani why i still recommend c it's a fruity scent made uh, it's very classy very chic uh, also it's um, it's very elegant we here we're gonna smell a lot of vanilla a lot of fl floral uh, notes uh, fresh notes sweet at the same time so um, if we can say Bleu de Chanel is a joker fragrance for men, we can say also C by Giorgio Armani, it's a joker fragrance. Yes, I, I know that uh, it's beautiful on fall and winter, but if the weather is still cool uh, in the spring uh, or in the, the summer of uh, or the nights of summer, I recommend you to wear this fragrance. Some women uh, love to be unique and uh, no woman smell like them so for that i propose angel nova by the house of mugler that it's contain contain or uh, uh, came with other perfume concentration as all uh, mugler fragrances uh, the quality is sure the performance also is sure uh, in the past was theory mugler and now it's mugler but the scent uh, is so so beautiful as i said before so uh, if you want something unique in this fragrance we see in the opening the lychee the lychee note mixed with the raspberry and uh, the scent gonna be so so beautiful when it's dry uh, it's uh, become more woody more sweet more powdery uh, due due to this beautiful blend so uh, angel nova it's a good fragrance for the unique woman and now I think uh, I think this is the best scent of women that I have ever smelled. Wow! 
Mont Blanc signature. If there are any woman in this channel who has tried this fragrance before, please tell us your experience in comment because this fragrance is very, very beautiful and it's a masterpiece by the house of Mont Blanc. How does uh, Mont Blanc signature smell? It's very cozy. It smells fresh, smells clean at the same time. It's, a, it's good for women that work on school, like a teacher. Also, if you are women work in office, I highly recommend this fragrance. It's a mature fragrance. It's very elegant, very classy. Uh, it's feminine at the same time. Very, very pleasant, powdery scent. I think Mont Blanc Signature didn't have that enough uh, uh, marketing for the scent. That's why not a lot of women know this fragrance. But when I, uh, when I uh, discover this fragrance, I highly recommend it if you haven't smelled it before. So in the end, I would like to thank you for watching this episode and see you in another Discovering Fragrances.